All right, this is 4K 30 linear with hyper smooth on high. Let's see what we got. No more talking. Let's get it down. Let's get on the water. Looking pretty good. I like my 60 frames though. All right guys, enough of walking around the boat ramp. Let's get out on the water, put it in to some action. out right now actually wanted to come back here and see how much bait was back here let's take a peek what's going on guys wanted to take a minute and show you what a cool baits 3 8 ounce underspin looks like it's got a four inch easy shiner on it and we'll take it up to this point up here in a second and uh, the winds blowing on it pretty good and there should be a couple fish on it so let's see if we can get bit but that's what I wanted to show you. The cool baits, it's their 3 8 ounce XL, and it's a fish catcher. Ooh, look at that glare, how you doing? I'm gonna scan this point with the side imaging and uh, see if we can't see some fish on it. And I'm gonna come back through and throw that, throw that underspin, that cool baits underspin. There's that massive tree everybody always gets hung up on. It looks like there's a fish or two on it. You can see that right there. There is not much going on with that point. I'm gonna go ahead and tell you. Let's see if we can get one off the tree. All right, guys, we are done for the day. I am ready to get to the house, check out this footage. I think it uh, I think it's going to turn out pretty good and I think you're going to see a clear difference between the GoPro Hero 7 black and the Hero 8 black. So let me get this uploaded, put it together and uh, see how some of this stuff turned out. I'm going to try to get you a few more uh, videos together of the features and uh, whatnot of the new GoPro and, and put them in real world test out here on the water and different scenarios. So uh, stay tuned and we'll see you later.